welcome back to my channel and if you're new here welcome girl your girl has made yet another huge Shein purchase and instead of me doing one big ass haul i decided to break them up in, into increments so be sure to check out the other hauls that i've also posted not right now okay don't you go nowhere and mess up the algorithm but it definitely does not have to end here i'll be sure to link the other videos below in the comment section this haul i think has about six items if i'm not mistaken and because i spent my own coins so i want you to come in them comments i'm talking about run to the comment section and let me know which item you think i should keep and which item you think i should sit back because i have no sham before we get started, I'm going to ask you to go ahead and thumbs up this video because I already know you're going to like it. And if you're new here, well, hello, welcome. I really hope this is not going to be your last time stopping by. And if you coming back, girl, give me some. That's why I was with you. All the links to these items or SKU numbers or item IDs, my measurements, the sizes I got these items in, a coupon code. All the tea will be pinned down in my comment section and found in my description box. Boo, you already know I got you. I real, this real is this real, this real. I ain't wear no damn dress this short since college days. Okay, and it's not that I don't have the legs for it because I definitely do. It's mentally knowing that I have to sit a certain way so that my damn monkey won't be out in in them streets for the free. And I don't like to be restricted. She like to breathe. She like to air out and see the way I be flashing people. So I, I kind of not mess around with, with, with the mini dresses. But this one is cute. It's definitely giving diamonds and pearls. Would you rather have a boy or a girl? If I could, I would give you the world. All I can do is just offer you my love. You need some pearls to clutch. I got a few. I definitely, I got plenty as a matter of fact. I love the off the shoulder detail. Got this in a 1X surprise that my arms, my big meaty arms made it in here. There is some scratch. Just a little bit. I probably could have went with a 2X. Maybe it would have gave me a little bit more length because I can definitely use some more material for my comfortness. It does have like a double layer effect. So it has the dress and then on top it has this material here, this sheer material that's causing the whole ruched effect. Um, but it's high and it can sit on all the lumps and bumps, okay? All the drapery. I like things like that, especially when we're hiding the fupa. And this dress definitely houdini did. My bitchy um girl you know i got them itty bitty titties and it fits right into the little mold that they created here on this dress so you probably gonna have some spillage i'm gonna just keep it real up top does have an elastic in the dress so for the bit back we in there anytime you get a ranch on some chocolate okay Standing here looking like a whole damn sun kiss or Fanta, honey. Whichever one y'all like, I prefer sun kiss. I hope y'all ain't drinking Crush. Yeah, this definitely, it is giving me childish or childlike. I definitely will need your assistance in bending down and picking shit up because my whole ass will be out in them streets, honey. Yeah, and I don't like that. And girl, if I put on some heels, you might as well say this a damn shirt. I'm 5'10". If you're new here, just keep that in mind that you will... It will come pretty short on you, but I know some girls don't mind that. It has that, that, that type of detail and that go up in the eyes, right on up in that, so it makes it look a little bit more plump, a little bit more peach-like. So for the ones that's lacking back there, this dress got you. I don't know, for some reason, whenever I film in orange, my whole lighting just do it, do, just have a mind of its own. So if it got a little darker, child, it, it's the dress. She ain't done did it again, sis. Done did it again. You know they infamous for not adding tags. So I can't tell you if I really got the sh on properly or not. I can't tell the front from the back. We gonna roll with the punches, though. I got this particular dress in a size 1XL. I most definitely could have went with a 0XL, probably even an extra large. The scratch is extensive. I mean, it gives my shoulders room to shoulder. 
the big back clan where y'all at give us room for our backs to back it even give our stomach room to stomach honey but the thing about this drink we gonna call it an eraser because you don't even see no fupa or lumps and bumps in sight this is that smock material and with smock there's a whole lot of stretch and give that be going on girl get into how it's cuffing and holding and securing the butt okay it's accentuating the curves and it's really making me look eatable honey. and when i took it out the pack it did have a little odor to it, smelling a little like chemicals. So we definitely going to have to air it out prior to winning it because we don't want to be around people giving them headaches. I love that it has some stretch and give here with the balloon sleeve. It's going to let your wiggle be able to jiggle without anybody knowing. The length is lengthy. I am 5'10". I'm pretty sure I said that already. And as you can see, it's a midi length. If you're shorter than me, then it may become a maxi. And I don't know how I feel about this dress being a maxi. Hmm. This is one of those type of dresses that you can wear somewhere everywhere. You going to church full day in the morning? I can see me right now with the Bible and a little church hat. And then right after that, I want to go to brunch. I can just remove all of that and add a red lip and boom, bam, I'm ready for brunch. I can wear this to work. Put on a little blazer over it, you know, and then the girls say, girl, let's go to happy hour after work. Okay, I remove the blazer and you know what I'm saying? Bring it down a little bit. It's a multi-purpose dress, and we all can use those type of dresses in our closet. I love, love, love a leopard print. It's been a very long time since leopard print has made its debut in one of my hauls. If you've been here for a while, there used to be a time where you would never see a haul that did not consist of a leopard print piece. Like, that's my favorite, favorite print of all times. I love this dress. I really do. It's really comfortable, and it's cute. Now, while I'm standing here looking like I'm I got on somebody's robe, child. And I, I, like I done came with the silk pajamas on, child. I mean, it looked real cute on Sus on the website. So I said, well, you know what? Let me give it a try. But, um, mm. now I did size up. I got it in the two ways because I figured the arms would be tight. For the arm's sake, I do feel like I, I chose right. But with the rest of the dress, I feel like I got a lot of extra material going on. Now, this is a full wrap style dress. Like, I literally can untie this, and you know what I'm saying? I can really get, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, one, it's one of those style of addresses, which I can appreciate. I love those because those typically hide your fupa area. But um, it seems, it's feeling like a, a little bit more material than I need. But then if I size down, it'd probably be too big on my arms. I'm not sure, sis. Okay, so we got the thigh-high split, which y'all know I really love a thigh-high split. I really do. Let me, I'm trying to back up so you can really get into it. Yeah, you see, I just keep, all I see is robe. It's giving, I was about to get it in with hubby and then the kids come to the door and interrupting. Okay, and then I had to come and put the robe on real quick and ask them, what is it? What can I do for y'all? It's very silk-like. The material, the quality is pretty good. It's giving rich bish. It's not horrible. It's not giving exactly what I thought it was going to give. I feel like I'm looking like somebody curtain. You know, like, I don't seen too many, like, some of the older people in their house. They have that drape for decoration style that's on their window seal. I don't know how to... If you know, you know. That's not the look I'm going for, sis. I do feel like this is really great for my bitsy bitch. Like, look at all this material. I don't see this as going somewhere. It kind of gives, remember once upon a time, everybody was wearing pajamas out the house as clothes, like outfits. It looked like a pajama dress, but it was wearing it at, you know what I'm talking about. That's what this is giving. I cannot get past the robe look, though. I can't get past it. I can't unsee it. This definitely is going bad. But let me know what you think. All right, boo. So let's get into this dress that I got on. And I got it in a size 1XL. Now, if you've been here before and you've watched a Timu haul of mine or Timu, how the hell you say it, you would have seen a dress similar to this where I didn't even have it on right because it didn't come with instructions. So I believe it was like an orange and pink instead of a black and pink. So I said, you know what? Let me give it another try. This time around, I got one with the long sleeve and, and black and pink. I think it's cute. I love the whole one, sh one long sleeve 
Okay, so I can stay warm on this side, only on one side, and then be a little chilly over here. It's okay though. I'm gonna be cute. I love, love, love how they have the little ruched and wrapped little style they got going on here. And I love that in this area it's black. We all know black gonna always make it look smaller than what it is. So the fact that it's wrap style, ruched style, or whatever you want to call it style, and then it's black on top of that girl. Just kiss. It's giving me all the curves. All the curves. If you have mini arms, you're probably going to want to size up because I'm a few cheeseburgers away from not getting up in here. Had I had one more plate during the holidays, I probably wouldn't have made it up in this arm here because it is tight, girl, okay? It's really, it's a little tight. Feeling rubber bandish. Now, we can't just walk on by without talking about this split here. And this is one hell of a split, honey. It's, the split is definitely splitting. It's giving, before you come over, gotta shave my chocha. You do what you don't know, no, will I won't chop. It's definitely giving, you gonna have to make sure you trim up some of them hairs or the bush gonna be out there for everybody to see. It's literally right there. Right there. Why they douche like that, I have no idea. Maybe it's because of my height that it hits right at the cooch. It's more like a spandexy type of feel material. Oh, no, I love when it's like a whole two-tone ensemble. Because these back here is giving Black Lives Matter. Okay, and then we can turn around over here and it's giving a little splash of Pepmo Bismol. Cotton candy, if you will. Bubblegum. Pink Panther. I like that. It's, it's a mystery, honey. We're going to call this one mystery. Because from behind, you would have never knew I had this little pink here. And then I have a little pink going on right here. I personally like the style of the dress. It's just that, that my pocketbook out of these grease, that, that ain't gonna fly with me. Yeah, no. Especially not how the hell I like to sit. You definitely gonna have to just stand up all night long in this one. All right, boo, so let's get into this final dress of this haul. I started off with orange, uh, orange, and I'm gonna end with an orange. Now, I got this dress in a 2XL because I wasn't sure how tight it would fit on my arms, and it does give me some extra room. So I probably could have gotten it at a 1XL. Um, because I sized up, it's a little more looser and more material in the lower area. So down here, it's not as snug as I would have wanted it to be. I did my little hands up. Wave your hands in the F, wave them side to side to keep your hands high. I realized that I'm taking the dress with me. I'm literally about to come out of the dress boobs out everything so i'm gonna have to ask you or somebody who with me when i wear this dress would you mind getting that for me I have to hold on to the material and point over there otherwise girls going wow other than that i love the color of course on this skin tone it's gonna always be a look i do love the material it's giving more of like a silky type of feel it does have a little split here and I like the length of it. It's not too far up, not too high. It's not even going up as I move around. Like, it, it got a little respect. Too short. It's not too disrespectful. It's a very beautiful color. Um, I like it. I just got a size down, maybe. It's really not my favorite, though. To be honest with you, this haul was a little meh. It was just meh. Well, boo, we done made it to the end of this haul. And you already know I want to know which item was your favorite. Girl, come and talk to me in them comments. I most definitely talk back. If you got a car full of sh make sure you're using my coupon code to save you a coin or two or three. Before you go, make sure you thumbs up this video that lets YouTube know that this video needs to be in the YouTube screen for everybody to see. Make sure you drop this emoji down in the comments down below if you made it to the end of this video. That's how I know it's real. I want to thank you so very much for taking the time out to watch my video. Until next time. Later.